What is up everyone? Welcome back to another part of Red Dead Redemption 2. Let's jump right in. Okay, I do want to mention I wasn't recording. But Strauss, I asked him if Micah put the money in the camp funds and he didn't. I knew it. I was like, he didn't put any money in there. It was supposed to be, what, 1400 I knew I should have taken it. Where's Micah? I need to talk to him. Miss O'Shea? Okay. because it means I work so you don't have to. That's not right, is it? I guess not, miss. You're right not, missy. On. Oh my god. I've had enough of you, you sour old hag. Don't start with me, Arthur. I'm only kidding around. Do you think I'm in any mood at all for this? <laughs> I feel like you're always in a bad mood sometimes. Morning. There she is. You okay? You don't shame yourself. I'm all right. She looks really tired. Okay, just making sure. The moment that Miss Grimshaw left, she started laying down. All right. Where is Micah? Good morning, Arthur. Why have you got a guilty look? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> okay. You're up to something, Miss Jackson. Tell us about right, it. Arthur. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna find Micah. He would have killed me. I want to find Micah, man. Where is he? Let's go to Valentine. If I have to get it off his dead corpse, I will. Oh no. my tongue today and now my tongue is like dying <laughs> it hurts so bad <laughs> maybe i'll have a bounty finally i've been waiting to get a bounty and i haven't gotten one in quite a while hey, you're here again hey brother what are you doing hey mister mister i never learned your name i never did you're like a brother I didn't learn your name. <laughs> and I said to myself, Mickey, you never learned that fella's name. Now, you'll never see him again. And you'll be sad. Like Don't. when your poppy passed. Because you slept on it. What? What's your name, mister? Arthur. Arthur? My uncle's name was Arthur. Uncle? Arthur, we called him on account of his name. It's a fine name, mm. a strong name, mm -hmm. like a king. That's right. You could be my king, Mr. Arthur. <laughs> yes, you could. <laughs> oh, see you later. Yep. Howdy, fellas. Good morning to you. We're gonna be raising yeah. sheep. So, feeling better? How's your scar? I heal pretty fast. Mm. Lucky you. So you just lazing about, or you got any leads? I got something. You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now. <laughs> Maybe. Come on. Well, where exactly are we going? Collect something. Help us get some sheep. Uh, you know, that attempt to seem all enigmatic and interesting, that might work for Dutch, but for you, it just makes you look stupid. <laughs> Come along. You'll see. That train job was a start, but we need more money. Until we can get back to Blackwater and collect. I'm here to tell you. How much is in Blackwater, man? If we collect that money anytime soon, it'll come with a noose. I was worried you'd say that. 
You can't be Dutch that bad. Says Dutch says a lot. That's his gift. Saying things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was a prize pony once. Now I'm the workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well... You was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkerton's here. New century's coming. This life, this way... Well, we're the last, I reckon. And we ain't long for it. Then that's the way it goes, I guess. For me, yes. All right. So where are we going? Just need to pick up something. Where are we going? There's a hitching post over there. Tether the horse and I'll meet you across the street. Morning, morning. Well, I already don't like how this is going. <laughs> Wait, where's the hitching post? Over here? Okay. <laughs> I was like, where did he say it was? Are we going to the gun shop? Yeah, we are. Gun store? Yep. You, uh, head in, pick up a sniper rifle? I'll explain later. Oh, Making well, me spend a lot. <laughs> How can I help you today? Looking for a rifle? Something with a sight on it. Shouldn't be a problem. You want to see what we've got? It's all in the catalog here. Oh, oh, it doesn't cost anything. <laughs> nice. Okay, we don't need to make it fancy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. See you later. Sure. Yep, I got Let's it. Go. Where are we going, though? He explains nothing. Let's go, boy. Yeah, clean my house again. Why couldn't you have done that? I know. I was thinking done that too. What? Walk that gun. I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. You had a run in. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. <laughs> It's done now, ain't it? They like me now. Why are you be so cagey about all this? I know. I'm always playing some goddamn game. Exactly. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No. Yeah, you, you aren't. aren't. Yeah. If you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Because my life Just is revolving around everything about another. yours. Not be two people at once, that's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. Same as with you and that girl... What was her name? Mary? That was different. No, it ain't. Just the same. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? <laughs> There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Yeah, I know that place. <laughs> I'm glad that I'm not the only one that notices he's never literally with his family ever. <laughs> it's a cactus that I just walked over. Oops. No, you stop going over the cactus. <laughs> Head up to the bridge up there. Get a proper view. I gotta use the cinematic mode more. I always forget to. And it looks so good. <laughs> so I'm thinking that the herd will make it to auction all right, but a couple of new ranch hands will be collected on the sale. Doubt the town will care to notice too much. Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not till we know what we're dealing with. Let's see what we can see from up here. Hmm. Only 13 shots. 
Okay. I think that's them over there. The one now? Put a shot in near them. I reckon they'll hightail it. They're only ranch hands. Just oh, there they are. Watch the sheep. Oh, I wasn't supposed necessary. to shoot him? I wasn't supposed to shoot him? I don't... Looks like one of them don't scare too easy. I didn't know. In close. He'll get the message. I thought I thought it was That's cheating. Them, all right. <laughs> I feel bad. All right. Let's go round him up. I feel bad now. Can I have a redo? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm a man. I'm a man of learning. Okay. Let's go get the I'm Martha Morgan. You ever work on a ranch, Marston? No. You? No, oh, day here, or there, but not much. We're not gonna talk about Those it. Cowboys <laughs> I know are dumb as trees. How hard could it be? I guess we'll soon find out. Let's get these things. Bring them back to the yards. I have to collect all the little sheeps. Oh shit! Oh, I thought there was sheep over there. They're pretty scattered. Let's get them all rounded up. Whoa! Whoa! Yep. Oh! You ain't helping. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to. Marston, why don't you leave the sheep to me? You ride Shank. Keep watch for any trouble. I was trying to get him to go. But I'm stuck. It'll be quicker this way. Trust me. This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to hurt. All right, whatever you say. Uh, can you control that damn horse? <laughs> I'm done arguing. That's more like it. Well, aiming the There's some getting away. What about that one back there? Which one? Got left behind? Okay, sheep, we gotta go. I don't wanna I don't wanna run you over this time. <laughs> Keep thinking John's a sheep. Because <laughs> he looks like one on my on my map. Don't don't cut me off, sheep. I don't want to run you over, please. We'll be making next week's auction at this rate. Yeah. Shut up. <laughs>
Perfect. See? We only lost one. Those are up, boys. There you go. Hopefully these guys don't notice. Fine sheep. They're okay. Have you seen better around here? I've seen ones with less ambiguity about their provenance. <laughs> A lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me? Sure. I'll excuse you for 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15. 20. 18. Done. <laughs> Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Uh, mm -hmm. fine, but we're paying. Go on now. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dutch is waiting for us at the saloon. Yes. Dutch at the saloon. Let's get going. Percent. I thought we was doing right <laughs> here. Still we're, getting money. Yeah, we're still profiting. Well, thanks for all the help with this. <laughs> can't herd, can't swim. Give it a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. <laughs> Never really was. Oh, is that this saloon? Oh, I get this one. This one's okay. <laughs> You're taking my spot. <laughs> yeah, move over. Come on, sunshine. I'll buy you a whiskey. <laughs> my horse's name is Sunflower. He called me Sunshine. We match. How adorable. <laughs> Not everything. But After in the you, end, sir. I don't believe in absolutes, just shades of gray. Compromises. Compromises. Uh, gentlemen. Dutch, me both. Where have you been? Working. Marston's thing. Good. And? We're just waiting to get some pay on um, a few mm. sheep. Leopold, my good friend, as long as you're here, why don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course. Gentlemen. Drink? Sure. <clears throat> Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. <laughs> I should have left him drink. where I found him all those years ago, bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well, I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school <laughs> has some strange graduates. That it does. To your good health. Thank you. Oh Get God! What the hell? Vandalin! Oh shit! You don't know me. But oh you keep no! Robbing me. My name is Leviticus Cornwall. I am not a man <sighs> to be messed with by the likes of you. Get out here before I have these men killed. Oh my God! What do you think? Get out here! Well, I. Trash. You start spinning a yarn. When I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. Why not? Like you rob from me, you're done. Now get out here now. Deal with this nonsense. He's running, talking Wait. big until the moment Tell we me. come out. This is a terrible mistake. This is a case of mistaken identity. What is worse than admonishing a man for the sins of another? Who wants to be the Messiah? Not me, nor do I want to be this Dutch man. Shit. Only did one. Oh, did he shoot me? Get out of the way, Dodge! You're in the way. I'm <laughs> like trying to shoot. 
out. I was surrounded. Nice. <laughs> I, I forgot to mark when I was doing it. <laughs> We're gonna be wanted in here too. Taking. I like the sound on. Back of John's horse? Shit. <laughs> I thought I was putting it on mine. You make sure nobody's following us. We'll get back to camp. We're gonna gather the troops and get them to start packing up. Oh, we're leaving? Oh, we can't stick around after this. Let's go! <laughs> I like yeah. this time. Alright. I better get out of here. Still alive after that? Pistol. Oh! <laughs> Go straight. Just go straight. <sighs> I tried to turn as much as I could, but the horse, my horse couldn't turn as much as I was hoping. Oh shit, there's a lot of trees here. It's hard to look behind you and be able to go the correct way. I can pay off the bounty. <laughs> How high do you think it's gonna be? <laughs> it's probably gonna be really high. I was not expecting that at all. 
But I kind of knew that something bad was gonna happen, especially with the other ones. Where the hell am I? I'm back here. I feel so bad. <laughs> <laughs> I did a, I did a whole front flip. <laughs> I was not expecting that. <laughs> mm, they're still coming down here. Okay, we're good. <sighs> Let's see how bad I did. <laughs> I, I didn't take any health items. <laughs> We'll get better, okay? <laughs> We're still learning. <laughs> what a nightmare. I was not expecting any of that. <laughs> I wasn't prepared. West Elizabeth, where the hell am I going? Hold on. Okay, I'm going the right way. That's what I thought. It's like I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way. <laughs> yeah. I just started learning this area. I can now get to some places without using the map, just by memory. Because <laughs> I've been riding around so much. <laughs> Oh my god, what the fuck? Is that a dog? I don't want to step on. My hat! Where are we? Yep. Only 60. It's only 60 dollars. I could pay that off. I could pay that off, okay? That's not bad. I'll definitely pay that off. And then I'll say hi to everyone in the town. And slowly gain their trust again. Okay? Yes, that's the plan. Hey! Who's that? It's me, Arthur. Well, look who it is. Now, one that sounds sincere. I'm not playing. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ. Hit him to the ground? What the hell? <laughs> oh my god. Well, that was stressful. Wow, well, they've really packed up everything. So we keep heading east. Is that the plan? For now. And when do we stop? When we reach Paris? Well, that'd be nice. Join the commune. We stop when we find someplace sensible. Shake them that's following us and lie low. This is lying low? turned into a bunch of killers. I mean it. We ain't even got the delusion of being anything but a bunch of killers. We are just trying to survive, Hosea. We don't have a choice. This will end soon. Damn hmm. right it will. Constipated as usual. I so, like Hosea. Yeah. Micah told me of a place we can lie low. Look here. Dewberry Creek, he said. Dewberry okay. Creek. Maybe you and Charles can go take a look, clear off anyone you find before the whole lot of us move in looking so conspicuous. And how are we gonna do that? I don't know. Start dancing? Looks like I turned into a goddamn errand boy. You have turned into my son. You worry because I worry. We are just the same. Charles, come mm. with me. We got work to do. Sure. Charles. Just wait. How's it going, Javier? Hey, Javier. Ugh, Your got my eyes so itchy. It's looking well. Thank you. You're a good horsey. I'm sorry that I ran you into the thing. <laughs> you deserve a pat. You You're all right, good. boy? Boy. So, 
Are we riding there? I guess so. How far is it? Oh, it's actually not that far. So that's the line for Valentine. I haven't gone over there. Maybe I should go over there. I'm gonna ride here though. Mm, it's not that far. I'm gonna run right into that horse. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> Why is he trying to challenge me? So where are we going? Find a new spot to camp. We're packing up and moving on. Again? We have to. Fast. We'd already pushed our luck too far before that mess we just made in Valentine. Uh, that didn't sound good. Uh Killed a lot of law. Hold up a second. Oh shit, he's slow. I'm sorry, I didn't know I was going too fast. We gotta stick together. Sorry, I'll stay with you. So, anyway. Uh, killed a lot of law. Killed a lot of Cornwall's men. They must know where we are by now. So we're heading south? Yeah. Area called Dewberry Creek. Dutch wants us to give it a look. Make sure it's clear and a good place to lie low for a while. I've only known him a few months, but the way he talks, I never thought I'd see him wanting to head south. Right. And I know by now, there ain't no lying low. There's too many of us for that. And there ain't no way Dutch is gonna just hide away in a cave somewhere. Goes against everything he stands for. That'd be admitting we're nothing more than low-down criminals. Which we are. <laughs> you don't have to tell me. I wonder how accurate this map is to what's supposed to be the Rocky Mountains. Cause that lake looks really familiar. <laughs> Running into me, huh? Got nothing to say? Huh? So, where does it end? Where does what end? The moving, the running. <laughs> Dutch don't see it as running. Call it what you want. I don't know. Before, put enough time and distance between you and the problem, eventually, it went away. And this is a big country. But now, with these Pinkertons and better paid bounty hunters, I ain't so sure. Well, it would be Maybe the way the price on our heads got too big. Yeah, they've certainly got money behind them. It's just getting they've bigger. They've got Cornwall's money behind them for one, which guarantees even more trouble. pay off the bounty though. I'm gonna do that and see if I can go back to town and hopefully no one will be too mad at me. Well, I think there must be it up ahead. The old dried up creek. Seems very open. Yeah, it does. Ain't sure to be the best in the rain neither. Well, let's take a look around. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about hey. this. I see something over there. Yeah. You see it? Someone on the ground there. Yeah. Wee. Oh, there is a person. He's been shot. Let's be careful, Arthur. Hmm. Looks kind of. There's a old. camp just up ahead. Sure. Let's get ready for business. Any issues? Shoot first, debate second. I'm not gonna shoot for the sake of it. Survival oh. for the sake of it. It's like right here. Talking. You started it. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about this. You see there? 
tents and a wagon. Looks deserted. Okay, well, let's have a look around and make sure. Hmm. Where is everybody? Maybe they heard us come. Be careful. I'm being careful. Mm hmm. Hmm. I see it smelling. You good in there, Charles? What is it? Someone's been here. Sure. Someone's still here. There ain't no one here now. I ain't so sure about that. Oh, they're all right here. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. It's okay. It's okay. You can come out of there. You okay? You don't mean to no harm. He said, are you okay? Sprechen Sie Deutsch? German? No. Needs just. Now go on. Get out of here. Go. We need the land. Go. Get they could the stay. hell out of they here. They took our father. Who did? Men. Last night. Where? Where did they take him? They ain't no business of ours. I don't even speak their language. You ain't as tough and dense as all that. Come on, Arthur. <laughs> the girl was pointing this way. Let's see if we can pick up a trail. Let's go. I kind of like Charles. Seems like a good man. There. Tracks. Come on. I don't see nothing. Hoof marks. This way. What's going on with you? What do you mean? You were just going to send that woman and her children on their way? We're wanted, man. We got Pinkertons braiding down our necks. We should be moving camp, not running off on some wild goose chase. Come on, Arthur. <laughs> That's not how you are. Well, maybe you don't know me as well as you think you do. Wait, just let me make sure this is right. What? Oh, he's looking at the tracks. Okay, looks like they go down this way. So... What happened with those Pinkertons, anyway? When you were fishing with Jack? Said they were on to us. Offered me freedom if I turned Dutch here. <sighs> they picked the wrong man there. Easy. We should have moved right <laughs> then, if you ask me. Think this is the right way? Give me a second. Got it. Continues along the shore here. So what were you talking about before? Bastards told me they killed Mac. Said it right in front of Jack. Ah, uh, that kid. It's gonna be tough for him. Yeah. But he has more folk looking out for True. him than most of the rest of us had growing up. Bye. John said he was going back to the auction yard to collect the money for those sheep. He'd be a damn idiot going anywhere near that town right now. Uh, he reckoned he'd be able to slip in and out. Oh, well. If it's John's <laughs> idea, it must be a good one. <laughs> what is it with you and him? Poor dog. Uh, he disappeared on us for a while. But Jack was real... Hold up. Let me check this.
This horse looks cool. They carry on along this trail. It's like I was talking about when Jack was real young. A long while. Year ago. He did? And we was family, you know? Guess I still yeah. ain't fully forgiven him for that. It'd be hard. There's Especially on the sun. Be careful. Seems deserted. Let's take a look. I wonder what John was doing that year that he's gone. Where is this guy? I don't know. But you know something? This is a better camp spot than back there. Much easier to defend. True. Maybe. This does look like a good camp spot. I hear him. There he is. Quick, cut him free and let's get out of here. Oh, this is the. Oh shit! It's so dark. What the hell do you think you're doing? You won't get out. What are we doing? This ain't even our goddamn fight. Get rid of these bastards! That on them doesn't look like it. Look out, right? Nice. <laughs> right in the shoulder. Last one's making a run for it. Take him down. No, not the horse. Where is he? I can't even Let see him. See what they've left behind for us. I couldn't even see that. It's so dark. I can't see anything. <laughs> I don't know how. Especially with the fire being right there. It made them almost impossible. I thought you wanted to get this over with, Arthur. It's okay. Getting you out of here. Vielen Dank für Ihre Hilfe. Yeah, okay. Here you wait there a second. Charles, go find Dutch. Get the caravan to divert here. This spot should work for us. I like the spot better be. too. Come on, let's go. If I get these bodies out of here, that's not gonna be fun to be rotten. Mind me just looting everyone really quick. Okay, that's good enough. We'll just go. Okay, come on. Alright, come on. I'll take you back to your family. Hat meine Familie sie geschickt? Also soll ich mitkommen? Yeah. He doesn't even answer because he has no clue what he said. Maybe they should join us. Slowly create a bigger family. Wo bringen Sie mich hin? What the hell did you do to those fellers? Wie bitte? Those men back there. Why did they take you? Geld, money. Meiner Familie gehört eine Goldmine. Mm. Sie wollen Lösegeld erpressen. How did someone even come up with them words? <laughs> Sie bringen mich zu meiner Familie? Vielen Dank. Wie haben Sie sie gefunden? Look, I'm sorry, friend. I can barely speak English. <laughs> yeah. Where is the trail? There it is. Like, I know it's around here somewhere. Oh god. That was weird. It wouldn't let me go between that rock. It was like, nope. You don't want to go there. That would be bad if I got flipped on my horse <laughs> with him on it. Okay, I think we're almost there.
Those pigs? I don't think I've seen a pig at all. I didn't even know they were here. I guess boars. Let me be more accurate of what they are. Shit. That's not it. That's where my ex is. <laughs> but close enough. They're right here. Dem Herrgott sei Dank! Schatz! Oh. Andreas! Oh. Andreas! Ich hab gedacht, du seist tot! Meiner oh. wärst du gewesen! Meine Lieblinge! Meine Herz allerliebst! Oh, wie wunderbar! Oh. Sie sind ein großer Mann! <lacht> ja! Ein großer Mann! Ja, wirklich! Es ist ein Segen, dass Thanks. wir sie getroffen haben! Come on, now get out of here, this place ain't safe! Get out of here! Ja, ja! Camel! <lacht> Ich hab was für Sie. Einen Moment. Uh, um, Dankeschön. Thank you. A gold Vielen bar? Vielen Dank, herzlichen Dank. What do I, do I even do with this? Guess it was a pleasure. <laughs> yeah. Tell me if you need saving again. <laughs> I won't mind. <laughs> Oh, this place. Oh, it'll be perfect for us. Hello, Arthur. Dutch. This is a good little spot. It was fun. <laughs> it would have been funny. Mr. Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson. At least I didn't have works. to Make this drive the carriage this time. Well, I don't know where the hell we are, but we are going to make the best of it. Hey, new things to explore. I'm gonna pay off my bounty. Chapter three. We finished chapter two. That was the end. My horse is out of whistling range. What do you mean? <laughs> I haven't even loaded in. Chapter three. Clemens Point. A few days later. God, this game is a masterpiece. And I'm two chapters in. Isn't there like five or something? I don't know how many chapters there are. <laughs> how you doing, old friend? Hi. Um, it's funny. Us in and up down here. My daddy died in a field in Pennsylvania, fighting this lot. I ever tell you that? Many times. <laughs> I see I'm boring you, Arthur. No. <laughs> Worrying me. We lost men back there. We have lofty goals, Arthur. We're trying to reform society to a kinder, truer, better way. Now, of course, there's gonna be casualties. We're thieves. You know, a world that don't want us no more. We are dreamers in an ever duller world of facts now i'll give you that but come on this place is gorgeous i want to nice stay house. here old jose says that there's a trick around here i reckon it's full of fish <laughs> I feel like everyone knows that song. <laughs> I kind of like this place a little better, not gonna lie. It's kind of nicer, it's cuter, it has a lake that I can just throw myself hey, in. Old girl, come on down here. Why don't you show us this crick you've been pissing in? Hey, you don't look too rosy, old friend. I thought this warmer weather would. My days are looking good a long old <laughs> <laughs> Always green, crushing, and bubbling. Oh, where are we going, though? Come on, Jose. Let's go fishing. Oh, we're going on, fishing. Well, there's a fishing dock right there. Ha! Whoa! Let's get going. Why don't we just fish here? That, that's that's what I said. I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard. Before any of them back there. Oh, 
There was a us. The curious couple and their unruly son. It feels good here. You did well finding that spot, Arthur. Thank you. More Charles than me. It's like I can breathe again. Thick and soupy as this air is. Might even do your whistling pipe some good, Hosea. I was once in this country with Bessie. Ah, feels like a lifetime ago. It was a lifetime ago. <laughs> but what a life we have lived, how well we have fought, especially both of you. I yeah. hope so. But now, when things are desperate, we have to stick with the plan. Make enough money, then find somewhere where nobody will find us. Where we don't have to hide. Uh, like where? I got some ideas hatching, but I need you with me, not against me. Both of you. Of course. Still, we do need money. So keep a low profile, especially in the local town. After Valentine, I want everyone on best behavior here. No trouble. But start turning over the soil and the rocks. See what has trouble in rows. Okay. Dutch, we have got to be discreet. Imagine what a slew of rich, simple tins there must be down here. Oh, this is perfect for you, Hosea. You'll be able to play. Didn't that horse like just die? Nothing would give me greater pleasure than. Looks like law up ahead. Play it cool. Whoa! Easy now. Just play it cool. We did nothing wrong, officers. Hello, awesome day. gentlemen. Well, look what the cat drug in. I seem to have gotten myself in a switch. <laughs> Bother. Quiet back there. Let's see if we can't sort this out. <laughs> oh, gone. Are we already, already gonna cause problems? <laughs> oh, no. How are you, boys? Fine. This is quite some country you have here. We like it well enough. Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. Lee Gray. This is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. Hey, it's good to meet you. You a Scott? Partly. The best part. <laughs> of course. Now, tell me, sir, what did the silly, fancy fop back there do? Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm sure he wasn't. He is a magician. I know him. He's a fool. But he is not a bad fellow. Now, can we... Can we just... Uh... I wouldn't do that if I were you. I... Shit! I... The Anderson boys! I can't have more scandal! Well, allow us to help, my friend. Arthur! Chase wanted man. Uh, and and <laughs> take Archibald with you. Just what I signed up for. Come on, big Are we guy. gonna shoot them? Perhaps we can discuss the foolish magician. Let's go after that train! Oh my god. Do not shoot them, you hear okay. me? <laughs> Come on, hurry! Alright! Come on, we're losing them! Will you relax? We're not losing them! Faster, come on. This is as what fast as I can go. Arthur, Arthur Callahan. Faster, Mr. Callahan, please. My neck is on the line here. I get it. I'm doing my best. <laughs> so what are these fellas wanted for? Looks like the son of a bitch is going to make me. You sure I can't just shoot him? No. Did I not say that? You said plenty. Are we going to Are we going to make it? Oh! That must have hurt. <laughs> Leave them. Stay with that train. The train is going down to go through the station. Now's our chance. See if you can get alongside the train. Come on. See the flat carriage? Head for that. Get us as close as you can. You think you can jump on there? I. Hey, me. I guess. You ride like my grandmother. You are something else. <laughs> Get him off. <laughs> Come on, Mr. Callahan, I'm relying on you. Where are you going to run to? Catch him. Quick. 
quicker. Come on, shit bag. Go, get after I'm trying. Oh god. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't beat him in time. <laughs> I did not mean to go up here, but... Oh shit, this is locked. I thought that he would... I thought there would be a door here. <laughs> I thought there would be a door there, and then he, he would jump up onto the other one. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Why wasn't there a door on that side? What the fuck? What do the people in the front of the train do? Nothing? <laughs> I didn't mean to go up in the first place. There we go. It's just us then, law man. Come here. We need to bother. Let me go. Can't do that. Oh my god. Ow, ow, ow. How do you block that? This is really hard. Yes. Oh. Hello? Is everything all right in there? Well, I don't think he's dead. I think I <laughs> Can I get out of here? Oh, just about. Why is this place trapped? I have to pick him up. <laughs> that hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Bring him out here. Deputy. Sounded like quite a commotion. Is that him? I sincerely hope so. Old Anders Anderson. So what now? Take him in. Come on. A fine job. Well done. Thank you. And a pat on the back for me for stopping the train. I agree. There you go. Better. You are a natural. I know. All right, let's take him in. Follow there we go. Me. What about the others? Oh, we'll round them up. What's that over Anders there? back there is the brains of the operation, and that's really saying something. You're the boss. That was mighty that impressive, so sir. Pretty. I have to admit, I'd hazard a guess you've served the law yourself at some point. Well, I wouldn't exactly say that. Are you familiar with the area here? No, not really. On your right here, these tobacco fields? This is part of Caliga Hall, big estate belonging to the Gray family. Looks bone dry. Careful! Oh, well, you have to move over, yes, you're literally blocking me. We are in need of some rain around here, let me tell you. The Grays have lived in Caliga Hall for generations. Mm -hmm. Fine people. My family's been working for them for years. Sheriff Gray's the one I know best, of course, but they own half the businesses in town. Which town? Rhodes, sir. You don't know it? Where we're headed right now. Mm. Ain't what it was before the war, but it has its charms. I'm sure you already know of the Braithwaites. Like I said, just got down here. Another big family in these parts. They have an estate west of here. Awful people, truly awful. They've been fighting with the Greys for as long as I can remember. Sounds like quite the place you got here. Oh, this is so cute. Here we are. Welcome to Rhodes. Oh, up so there adorable. on your left is the Rhodes Parlor House. Very reputable saloon owned by the Gray family. We also have a general store, gunsmith, post office, train station, and of course. What more do you need? Yeah. Very little. Oh, good. They're back. And that's your friend, right? Yep. Okay. We're gonna stop just ahead on the right, outside the sheriff's office. Can you grab Anders off your horse and carry him in for me? Of course. Hey, fellas. This is my new town. Chop, chop. Don't just Shit. leave him slumped on there for the yeah. whole town to see. Okay, Oh my god, of course. Now's not the time. <laughs> Oops. Mr. Gray! We got him. 
Very good. I told you Arthur would deliver. Man has a passion for justice. That's wonderful. <laughs> so, uh, about my friend here? Your idiot friend is free to go. But no more trouble from you, partner. I promise you this was all just a big misunderstanding. However, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Now, I'll pretend to appreciate that. <laughs> Mr. McIntosh, it has been a real pleasure. The mostly good citizens of Rhodes, we welcome you. Well, we're just honored to be here. And make your friend behave. We got enough trouble from some of the residents, old timers who've gone sadly to seed and lost their dignity. How terrible. Come along now. I will keep this fellow on the straight and narrow. Well, come back and see us sometime soon. Excuse me, gentlemen. Uh, Bo, these better be ugly rumors. Is it true you were seen talking to that wretched Penelope Braithwaite? I can't Penelope, that was one of the where gunsingers, right? Am I crazy? And where you Here, I'm renting a caravan on the edge of town behind the church. It's horrible, but no one comes looking. The whole town is trapped <laughs> in this interminable feud between the two families. His lot, Grays and Braithwaite's. Interesting. Two old plantation houses and falling out of rebel gold. I think I've heard of them. Marrying no, cousins or not marrying. Someone mentioned that before? Jose, you start poking around. See what you can find out about that. I have missed you, boys. I've heard about bounty. Well, there's been a price on my head for 13 years. It'll take a month to find us down here, and it seems like we can have a little sport. Well, they're good bounties. Where you hear this? Some fellas I met at a camp near the state line said there was talk of it in bars in the north and west for 500 miles. There was talk of super agents or some such. Super agents. <laughs> Hmm. I'd love to meet one. <laughs> Just talk. I'm sure it is, but I couldn't not tell you. Stay out of trouble. Thank you, gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. I need my hat. I feel so loved. Okay, it. so these two plantation families. Arthur, you start sniffing around the Gray's place, see what the story is there. Yeah, I passed by it earlier with our friend, Archibald. Good. Hosea, you see what you can find out about these Braithwaites. All right. Thank you, Arthur. Quite a fishing trip. <laughs> time. I'm up for it. <laughs> How about you, Arthur? Have you had enough of the chase for one day? Ah. Uh... Sure. Why yeah. not? Great. Hosea. Why don't you lead us to that spot you were So we were actually about. going fishing. I thought it was just a ruse. I kind of like this place. Me too. Okay. Let's see if we can avoid any more excitement. Hold on. It's really bothering me that that's there. <laughs> Wait, I want to see where we are actually. In relation to everything else. Ah, so we're lower. I wonder if you try to ride down there if you'll be able to go there. place is huge so how far is this creek it's a bit of a ride still and it's not a creek it's the same lake we camped on just a different pipe it'll be worth it I saw some big drum and sturgeon there should be rock bass bluegills perch mm -hmm. pickerel too it's a nice. good spot We'll see if you're as good at catching fish as you are at catching criminals, Arthur. Trelawney owes me for that. <laughs> Trelawney owes everyone for something, but his information is good. Plus, we are now ingratiated with the local law. I'd True. say it was a worthwhile diversion. I agree. Trelawney's like a bad penny. I'm not sure how good a magician he is, but he's certainly good at disappearing when he feels like it. <laughs> I know, I feel like we have go? never seen him. Everywhere and nowhere, it seems. We wouldn't have got Sean back if he hadn't been weaseling around down that way, though. True. Hey, Dutch, remember <laughs> that time you found him in the outhouse? <laughs> oh, yeah. We hadn't seen him in weeks. We stopped in some dead-end town in the middle of nowhere. Don't even remember the name. 
You and Bill were off doing something, Arthur. <laughs> so, we pick up some supplies, I go to relieve myself, open the door, and there's Trelawney, <laughs> sitting there, newspaper in hand. Mr. Vandalin, I say, what the hell are you doing here? And he <laughs> said, I can <laughs> do the same thing. Now, if you wouldn't mind giving me a little privacy, I'd a rotten oyster. <laughs> A hundred chalonies. What a terrible thought. <laughs> Careful. So what Trelawney said about those bounty hunters. What you think? This is the spot. Down to the left there. Oh. I guess he doesn't think anything. <laughs> Damn it. Easy. Yep. I saw some boats around last time. Be good to get to deeper water. Hey, those are the boats you mean? Yes. Good. I'm gonna go boat fishing. Nice. I'm sure nobody would mind if we borrowed one of these. Come on. Can I pause in the middle of a mission, though? I want to continue, but I, re I really can't. <laughs> oh. Let's see. We're going to see if I can save. <sighs> Story. No, I can't. Which is fine. We'll just continue, I guess. I'll just... All right. This looks like a fine vessel. I agree. Okay. Come on, Arthur. Let's get her in the water. Huh? Oh, oh. I got a good feeling about fishing here. <laughs> it's supposed to be some incredible sturgeon. Oh. Okay, here we go. <sighs> Let me row. You boys are too old for real labor no more. You're too dumb for anything else. <laughs> <laughs> You're still too quick for me, old man. I enjoy picking on children. <laughs> now take us to the deeper water and pray for good luck and stupid fish. Well, what about stupid luck and good fish? That'll do too. Head towards the middle of the lake. Go fast, come on. Yeah. Getting speed. <laughs> I think here's good. All right. Good luck, gentlemen. Should really come here at dawn or dusk. That's when you catch the best fish. Really? We should use a lake lure. That'll give us a much better chance of hooking something big like a sturgeon. What's wrong with a good old worm? Oh, worms are good for tiddlers like bluegill and rock bass, but you'd have to be real lucky to catch a sturgeon with one. Lures it is, then. You heard the expert, Arthur. How far I went. Nice. Keep the lure moving slowly on the water so it looks like a little fish just asking to be eaten. Okay, that was a bite. There he is. And where's my fish? You got something biting, Arthur. Fish on the line, Arthur. That feels like a bite. There we go. Shit. Got away. Nice. I feel like I've played so many games that have fishing in them that I'll know how to fish. When I go. There you go. Well done, Arthur. They can grow nice. much bigger than that. Fella told me he once saw a monster lake sturgeon near the mouth of the river, just southwest of Saint Denis. Fifty pounder, he reckoned. <laughs> I would like to see that. Got him? Hey, Jose. You remember that time we sent Arthur out fishing? He came back with three beautiful bass. Ah, huh, this again? I don't think I do. Oh yeah, you do. 
He was maybe 20. 21, walked in all full of himself. We had a big feast, toasted him all night. This was 15 years ago. <laughs> oh, I remember now. <laughs> then, the next week, Arthur and I are at the market, and Fishmonger calls out, So how did you enjoy those bass? <laughs> <laughs> you can fish, or you can go drinking all day, rob someone, and buy some fish. Not bad, Arthur. True. I'm worth keeping that one. I used to go fishing with this feller back in the day. Wesley, his name was. Real miserable bastard, but he loved to fish. We go out all the time. But one day, we were river fishing when we see a funeral procession going over the bridge, and out of the blue, Wesley stands up, takes off his hat, bows his head. Then he sits down, picks his rod back up, and carries on. Doesn't say a word. So I'm a little surprised and say, Wesley, that was nice of you. And he replies, well, felt I had to. After all, I was married to her for 30 years. <laughs> oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, dear God. I might swim to shore. Well done. <laughs> keeping that one, eh? Yeah, I'm keeping all of them. Remember those big later. salmon I caught in Montana last year? We had a banquet planned that night until Kappa went and scoffed the lot. Shit. You never had control of that dog. Uh, he had some spirit, though. Never lost the puppy in him, right to the end. You know, I remember us saying how Blackwater was the furthest east we'd ever been. A as a group, I mean. Feels like the more we try to head west, the further east we end up. <laughs> yeah, all those safe That's spots what I was thinking. Out to lie low in New Austin after the ferry job. I liked it there. Still open and wild the way it should be. Somehow the desert makes you feel closer to the sky. No point us trying to get back that way anytime soon. Pinkertons have patrols out all over tall trees and great plains. We saw when we went back for Sean. Well, look at us now, huh? It could be worse. Plans change. That's just how life goes. Nicely done, Arthur. Thank you. That'll grill up nice. Did I ever tell you my mother's buried in Blackwater? Really? She is? Apparently yeah. so. I, I only found out from an uncle of mine years later. Last I knew, she was still outside Philadelphia. I left home at 15 and didn't see her again. She and I didn't always see eye to eye. Mm. I wasn't always a very obedient child. I wonder how old he is. I can only imagine. Still, I loved her in my own way. And she, me, in hers. <laughs> Somehow, even from the grave, she managed to have the last laugh. Now reel him in, Arthur. Good job, Arthur. We always fish. I have so many now. Oh, Arthur's pleased with that one. <laughs> Whoops. It's kind of relaxing. Especially on a peaceful lake like this. I wish I had my hat. I keep forgetting to put it on. <laughs> Got a nibble there, Arthur. You hooked him. Get him in, get him in. Come on, come on. Come You're on. Getting hang of I know. I'm so good. Okay, cool. You got a bite. Got one. Hey, I reckon we call it a day, fellas. Already? You yeah, we got a ton. All right. I think we got a decent haul here. Pearson will be happy. Should we head back? We could keep the boat. Not too far back to camp from here. Good idea. Could be useful. What about the horses? Well, they'll find their way back. <laughs> Just follow the shore south, Arthur. That was fun. <laughs> Thank you, <boys. laughs> Now, Hosea. Yes. How about a song? Okay. Um, 
<laughs> they always have these cute little songs. I couldn't wait till the tears was done. Threw her on the floor and I knocked off some. Mm -hmm. I wish to God I'd passed her by. Mm -hmm. I wish to God I'd passed her by. Taters got burned and so did I. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was pretty good. <laughs> but you know, so what cute. song we should be singing? What? Well, look at us. Three mariners. Ah, of course. Well, we three poor mariners to leak up from the sea. <laughs> we spend our lives in jeopardy while others live at ease. Shall we go dance this round and round and round? Shall we go dance this round and round and round? And here is a bully boy. Come with me on this round. Men that do our states disdain, but we care for the merchant men who do our states maintain. To them we dance this round around around, to them we dance this round around around, and he that is a bully boy come plant me on this ground of ground of ground of ground of ground. <laughs> Bravo! Well, you know, we should not let the folks back in. Indeed not. We button. What about horses, though? And right. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> All right. That was really cute. I think I. Well, I mean, we are gonna be okay. I know. Well, I always know. Whenever I got you two by my side, things are gonna be just fine. This place will be good for us. For now, anyway. I hope so. <laughs> well, I am going to take in the view. That's what I was doing I'll when we first got here. <laughs> well, that was good. I'm going to pause there, though, because that... <laughs> I just could not stop playing there. <laughs> Had a fun time playing... Uh, can't wait to play more and I guess we're on to chapter three which is super exciting I'm gonna pay off my bounty because I still want to be able to go to Valentine and stuff so definitely gonna do that but I will uh, I will hopefully be able to pay it off I don't know if it's gonna cost more we'll see I'll see you guys all in the next one bye now.